So if that gun is 350 and this one is 100,000, plus who the hell killed this? Is this real? It's real, absolutely. It's one of our customers, actually. One of your guns did that? Yeah. Laid him out. That's right. Hi, welcome to Pacific Sporting Arts. I'm Jordan. Nice to meet you. Hey, how you doing? I'm two chains, man. Nice What's up? to meet you. Nice to meet What's you. What's up, bro? I have a uh, Krieg off hunting shotgun right here. What? How old is this rifle? This well, rifle's maybe ten years old. Oh, so it's not like it seems like it's so antique or something. This is uh, what's called Turkish walnut. If you can see it, it comes from Turkey. See all this burl here, all this color. It comes from Turkey. You can tell. Yeah, she's from <laughs> Turkey. She's from Turkey. Twenty-five thousand nine ninety-five. It's ready to go. My daddy left me a twelve gauge when he passed, but there's nothing. Oh, do you see that? Oh my God, you see that? Man, what made you get into this stuff, George? <laughs> I've been shooting all my life, actually. Oh, as a really? matter of fact, yeah. Okay. So I just kind of fell man. into it. Yep. Got you. All right. What else you got going on? Show me what Come else on over here. Come on, Charlie. Let's see what else you got. What? And the world is this right here, bro. I mean, it just looks like a Terminator weapon or something. What's this? <laughs> this is an Anschutz 22 target rifle. Anschutz. This is what they use in the Olympics. It's just a little 22 single shot rifle. Really? Why is it so fancy? So these guys, they shoot in different positions, right? And they're shooting targets that are size of Lincoln's eye on a penny, you know, at sometimes 50 meters. So you need absolutely the best most precision equipment to achieve that, and that's what this is. That's why everything's so heavy. You can see how heavy it really is. Oh, it is heavy. So it adjusts this is shoulder here. Yeah, it adjusts okay. for your shoulder and then the height of your face on the stock. Right here. Yep. Let's get these glasses off. Let's see. I shoot sometime, obviously. Right. I have a little property in the south, and I found it better to do it between breaths. <laughs> Well, it keeps your body nice and steady. Do you know how fucking heavy this gun is just holding yeah. it right here? <laughs> and sometimes they, they'll hold it for a half an hour, 45 minutes. That's a workout. <laughs> Trappy, what you think? Yeah, okay, cool. What else you got? All right, so over here this on this wall, crazy, man. this is what really defines us as the most premier gun dealer in the United States. What's the name of that show where he shot and missed and struck oil? What's the name of that? Oh, Beverly Hillbillies? Yeah, is that the damn gun he used right no, now? No, not at all. What is this? This is a Beretta. So this company has been in business since 1526. 1526 they were making guns. That's right. Century. Let's go ahead and take a look. This gun's $110,000. Just one part of the price of this gun is the price of the engraving, the craftsmanship and the artistry that goes into it. This gun took over two years to engrave. Yeah, this dog has a damn duck in his mouth, and it says, made in Italy. So the owner then shot the duck, and, 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 and Trappy brought him back. This is the most expensive gun I've ever seen in my life, bro. If you like all this, I've got something really interesting for you to look at over there. That's crazy. This is part of a four-gun set. This is $354,000. So the majority of the people that buy these guns um, are rich ass white people. You'd be surprised who buys these guns, as a matter of fact. No, I won't. <laughs> you say it comes with four more guns, or you there's saying... three more guns in this set. We show them. To, what you mean, like a handgun? Or no, it's, it's a matching set of four different guns. So there's a 12, a 20, a 28, and a 410, each a different size and a different caliber. It's got the game scenes here with birds and then the scrolls, and it's all done by hand. Is that a bear? It's actually, it's just a different kind of hunting dog. Ooh, he got a duck, he got a duck, he got a duck in his mouth too. This thing has unicorns on it. John Wayne would be proud of you. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Trappy, see something you like? See anything you like? Trappy, which one you like, what color? Which engravement? <coughs> I must have smoked a bit of gunpowder. Cause that's what you gotta be on. To spend three hundred thousand dollars on one of them damn rifles, John Wayne didn't shoot it. I saw some reasonable ones, but a hundred thousand dollars. I mean, the engravement was really—it was advanced. It was another level. It was some stuff that looked like a masterpiece. I cannot even lie. They had dogs and bears carrying ducks and quails, so I can see that. But honestly, if you plan on hunting 
being a gun collector, would you spend over $300,000 for that weapon? 